you need your How to Make Lemonade book, a letter um, sound reference sheet, whichever one you choose to use, and a pencil. So we are working on our How to Make Lemonade book. We have decorated the cover, we sketched out all of our steps and we went back through and we stretched out words and labeled the steps. And now we are ready to write. Today we are going to write the first two pages. We are going to write first. So let's go ahead and turn to the very first thing we do when we make lemonade. Yeah. First, all right. So, um, the first thing I did was I squeezed the lemon into juice, right? And now if you were in kindergarten, you might want to just write, first I squeeze the lemon. Or first squeeze the lemon. If you are in first grade or you can, I would like you to add a little bit more details. So maybe I'm going to write first cut the lemon and squeeze it. First, cut the lemon and squeeze it. Now remember, we're stretching out the words. We're going to leave finger spaces in between the words and we're going to have a period at the end because we're writing telling sentences. We're teaching people how to make lemonade. So, would you please write what you do first? I'm going to do mine, but yours might be different. First, squeeze the lemon. So I'm going to leave a finger space and I'm going to start the word squ. Squ. Oh, I hear a queenie quail in there. Squ. E. Z. Finger space. The is a snap word. I know how to spell the. Lemon. Finger space, O M. Now yours hopefully looks different than mine because I don't want you copying me. If you need to copy this first page to get going, go ahead and pause the video and then you can copy it, but I'm not going to do the next page. You're going to do it by yourself. I just want to remind you to leave finger spaces between the words and put a period at the end. All right. Let's look at what happens next. So I might say, next, add the sugar, period. Now, if you are a more advanced writer, add some more details. Next, add, and I don't know if you remember in Mrs. Stalkup's video, I had to add two big spoons of sugar because it was so sour, right? Next, add two big spoons of sugar. Or maybe you like yours even sweeter and you want to add three big spoons of sugar. That's up to you because you're the one giving directions. So can you please stretch out the words? Now we're working on not having someone help us. You are working on doing it all by yourself. Stretch out this, the sentence, put a period at the end, and then give yourself a cheer. It's really hard to write all by yourself at the beginning, but you can do it. And then we're going to put the book away for today. Um, great work. See you tomorrow.